pretty whack, but what's not too whack though is Bowman Fair and Fox in this case. Right. Sweet Sweet versus Eon. Eon decided not to go to Joker like he did last like last match. And yet again, oh maybe he should have gone Joker because he's eating 40% off of that one Squirtle combo. That's kinda of how Fox is though in this game. Like Fox is very, very light, but well he's he's just, he's a very good fast feller, so right. well, I mean like being a good fast feller means you also get combo for days and back. Exactly. Look at that, Fox is at 94% already. Oh, almost. I thought I was going to do Tapper up there. Switching off Vibasaur though. I, I don't think that's a good idea for his matchup. I mean, Fox is at kill percent. So. Yeah. I think especially in this matchup, like Squirtle and Ibisaur would be the be like, his best choices. All right. If he needs to get like a, a grab kill, then like for sure like Charizard is good for that. But right, other that, Charizard is going to get combo for days against Fox. Fox kind of destroys heavies. Right. You kind of just hope that he like gets that like one this space like Ariel to get the grab. Although he does, he does also have the up the out of shield. But yet again, Fox just spacing all these aerials are so sick. And yet again, that's oh. what I was saying. That that, that up the out of shield. Very up B is super good. Yeah. That's really that's really nice. I like it. Oh, I like that switching the Squirtle immediately to kind of like get off of that Charizard. Is Semi's best of five, by the way? Uh, Semi's is best out of five. Okay, okay. So we're gonna see eventually five games between, these, between both these players. We'll see, though, of course. Uh, it's very learned to the set, after all. Ooh, but the Downer into up smash. Yeah. I thought that wasn't true in this game. Oh, well, that's totally true in this game. Okay. Ooh, quick forward to the off stage. Now, kind of snuff back to the double jump. That seems like the one thing that's is gonna be really good for Charizard, especially, is that Fire Breath off stage. All right. But the second he gets combo, does the second that he eats 60%, 78%. Oh my god. Get off of that squirrel, you're gonna die faster. <laughs> And just like that, Eon even up the percents almost. Up the interesting option that's in that situation. Yeah. Whereas if I said that if I was sore, people look at me weird. Right. <laughs> because up is a really good option in general. I mean not out of shield for Ivy Sore. Oh definitely not, but you know. Surprisingly not using too much Ivy like in general so far. He's using I'm a lot more Charizard and Squirtle in this matchup. I mean I feel like Charizard does have the kill power, Squirtle has the combo ability, and like Ivysaur is like both that weird, he's too slow to, to challenge Fox, and like Fox. Will, oh, oh, he was going for it. Oh, that was killed. I, that bold, I respect, respect. Bold oh and my brash, God. my friend. Bold and brash. Well, like belongs in the trash. Uh. <laughs> Just like Squirrel right now, apparently it took 80% from that combo. Jeez, yeah. Louise. No, what, was it worth it? Was it really worth it? I don't think so. I don't think that Flay Boost is worth it. Let's see him bring it back soon here, but he's getting a lot of damage. I mean, I feel like at this point, Eon's just waiting for that one, like, down air or nair to up smash. Oh, oh, he was looking for it. He was fishing for it and not going to be able to find it, but then he finds it there. Yeah, that Flare Boats is not worth it. Yep. Eon just took it away right after that. He had an insane 8% combo. I feel like if he had went for Bear instead, that would have been better. Mm -hmm, probably, actually. Yeah. Fox being really good for comboing, uh, for rack up combos in this game. His downfall though is that once he gets a higher percents, if he can't get like Sour Spot in there, he can't get like, apparently that down air works earlier, like, and it's yeah. up, like any of that in the up smash, like it's really hard for him. All right. He has to get a lot more, he has to go for reads more or anything else. Like. Yeah, but at the same time, like it's super hard to punish that nair or down air unless you parry it. Very, very true. But he's gonna switch to Joker this time around, okay. Yeah. Maybe yeah. he's just doing it for fun. Uh, it's, it's Fox seemed pretty dominant in the last game, right. but we'll see, who knows, I guess. You can do it, Squirtle! Uh, and here we go, Joker versus P-Trainer. Oh, quick down throw into grab, and then he'll get a quick uh, combo out of it. That may, that may think, make things a bit more tricky as well, too. Gun's gonna be, I think, especially good at, like, against this character. Just because, like, well... It's gonna be hard to be hard to it's be easier to suffer some coverage for anything else. Right. Just be very careful keeping this jump. But yeah. And yet again gets the grab and then the up throw up to, or the down throw up there. Oh, oh I like that. He dashed punch. away to, to avoid the line whip and then uh, go in for the down smash. It's really pretty hard to 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 like oh, barely range. Wow, I'm surprised. And I'll do it. Yeah. It's really pretty hard to pretty hard to like punish 
Uh, I was sorry when he was like playing it up beyond the ledge there, but that's super good from Neon. Very nice taking kill as well too. Ooh, but but Ford Smash taking it, wow. Yeah. Sword Smash has been pretty laggy, but they are actually pretty powerful. Squirrel's main main Squirrel mainly shines on his combo game. Right. It's very good. His up air springs, his up air strings especially are very very good. His up throw and down throw being like excellent combo throws. Back throw is a trip. Yeet. Yeah. <laughs> Super good. All right, That's here we go. Oh, oh he nice tech, nice yeah. tech. Normally down throw being a very good combo star for. His yeah. private sword usually so like 50% a lot of time. All right, because you can get the down throw upper and upper. Yep. Potentially not being as well, too. That's for sense. And yet again, uh, there's a down throw. There's the first up there, but not too. But oh. Oh, he. You know, that was that was really good on uh, Eon too. Like look for the, oh. the the counter right there, because you know he's gonna go for the second up air. I wanted to stomp so badly there after that. Uh, very good. Same in the Agudan there. Ooh, I like that. You know, using the fair to uh, try to catch the double jump. But oh, the back air is so good. Oh. Back air also getting rid of the Arsa in this case. Right. Just enough damage to do so. And yet again, he's just looking for that grab at this point. You know, all he needs is that one less hit. And the up smash. You no, know, up smash is such a good option out of shield because it hits behind you first. So it's. I feel like it kills like maybe a little bit earlier than up B, depending on. Uh, <laughs> Okay, I love that. I love that. That was super cool. But oh. unfortunately, Gun will be actually stuffing out Charizard. That's what I was talking about earlier. Gun's just super good. Yeah. His match for stuffing out ain't like pretty much every all of, all three of, of the Pokemon's recoveries. I mean, you see Squirtle just be like, okay, I'm gonna grab you, and you're gonna eat all this damage. But not if Joker has anything to say about it, though. You try to switch Pokemon to escape? No, you don't get to escape from this combo. It ain't happened this time. Oh, there's yeah. down there into up smash. So much, so much damage right. for a two-hit combo. Thank you, Arson. <laughs> and a quick and back back air. Yeah. We'll take it. Yep. This is best of five though. So Sweet Tea can bring us back. Could get that reverse three zero as well. Right. We'll see. We'll see what happens though. Of course. I mean, his Pokemon trainer was doing good, but like Eon is just slightly better. Yeah, again, uh, do you think we'll see the switch off of Pokemon Trainer at this point? Uh, I think it's possible. I'm not sure how well Pichu does against, uh, against Joker in this case. But it's... You might as well go for it. You're down 2-0 after all. all right. They kind of live that last stock there. But right. sing, sing with guns. I appreciate it. Definitely respected, to say the least. Alright, here we go. On to game 3. Go. Oh. Go ahead. Yeah, so yet again, Squirtle like you know, usually likes to start off with a grab combo, but you know, Joker can easily do the same thing to Squirtle. So getting a quick 30% off there. Oh, very nice damage right there though. Oh, you know, Sweet Tea was scouting out that roll re, but unfortunately not going to uh, back up in time for it. Yet again. Ooh, there's the. Right in by the up B. Yep. Ooh, I like that. Throwing out the, the Nair and then going for the grab immediately. Oh. That was a scary switch right there. It seemed like much, but like, he didn't have a double jump and those guns shoot super fast and saying, pretty far actually once the arson. Ooh, I like that. You know, shielding to avoid the Nair. And the up air will beat out the, the Pokemon switch. Even though Charizard's pretty heavy, Arson is pretty dang powerful. He really is just yet just get away from him at this point. Okay. And that's okay. I thought it was. Oh, very, very I nice. like that drift back to avoid the the down smash punish. I think honestly, when, once Sweet Tea gets uh, once Dark gets it's Arson in this case, you need to switch to Ivysaur. You need to like throw some more late raises. Just play a lot more passively in general. Just sit back and just. Oh, and I'm yeah, that was not true. That's that's the great thing about Jer about the Rebels Guard Jerkus counter. That is frame three and is very, very powerful, giving Arson a lot more quickly. Here we go, the up air combos and into back air, so that'll be 44%. But once again, Joker almost has Arson after that combo. That is the downside fine Joker in this case. 
Yeah. If you can get all that damage, but it just gives him more power, really. And yet again, all, all, wow, I expected uh, Squirrel to uh, bounce off the shield, but no, he just kind of slides through uh, in between the legs, I guess. I was about to say, he needs to switch, like, right now. <laughs> Ooh, but, but unfortunately, that, that was the wrong very time. Advice. Yeah. That's not a good time to switch. His Arsene's super powerful. He was at kill percent at Squirtle. It's just like, nah, dude, just Ivy Sword. Just Ivy Sword. <laughs> Yet again, here's the grab and knock. This is why you need a Pummel, because, like, Pummel will add on, like, just enough extra percent that that might kill. But you know what? When you get it there off, like that uh, off stage to get the Gimp, like, who needs to Pummel? Exactly, exactly. Yeah, I don't think you need to attack in that situation, but it's... Uh, Sweet Team not get the last hit of that, of that neutral area. I'll just drag him down. Yet again, those four tilts. You know, more, Squirtle four tilts like DK down tilt. Like you're just hoping one of them trips so you can extend your combo. Is that four tilt? Yeah, that, the, oh. the, 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 the the tail swipe. Yeah, yeah that, tail that, that, that's four tilt. Okay, I didn't realize. I looked like a down tilt to me. No, the down tilt's when, when he kind of like break dances on his back. Oh, okay, okay. That's down tilt. I see. Oh, oh, that's yep. a that was, yeah. that was weird. <laughs> that was that was like Squirtle or Squirtle. Ivy Sword was like in Joker's headbox and was like, "I'm gonna destroy you from within." Bam, and like kind of like sliced him open from the inside out. 